the second Dollar Tree haul. If you missed my haul from earlier today, when you have a moment, go back and watch that. I talked about a lot of items that are super famous and trending on TikTok that people all over the US are just going crazy over and finding in their stores. And I found a bunch of them as well. We just have a lot of name brand items being sold at Dollar Tree. And that is so amazing. Just anytime we can spend a dollar, but get something worth $8, $10, $18. I'm gonna show you guys something today that costs anywhere from like $12 to $18 in other stores, even Macy's. And I have them in my bag. But um, hey, you guys, my hands are really going through it. My nails are going through it. And I got the little, um, I've been wanting to try this since forever. And I got the little two pack, the little roller dupe fragrance and the little lotion yesterday. This is Light Blue by Dolce & Gabbana. This is supposed to be the dupe for Light Blue, and I'm wearing my vintage cute but ugly sweater today. It's so nice and warm. I'm gonna start off by um, putting on this lotion and showing you guys how it is and giving you my opinion on it. Let's remove the little seal. Okay. I'm doing great, how are you doing? Okay, so this is what it looks like. If you guys have ever been curious about these little fragrance sets, this is what it looks like. And I have a cat scratching on a door. Super annoying. Hi, Farusa, you're back. Yay. Okay, so it went on really lightweight. Let's see. It smells nice. Hi, Madison. It's not like too thick. It's not greasy. I really like how it feels. It smells nice. It doesn't smell very strong though. Like I would probably wear this as like a lightweight lotion. I always need to put on lotion, you guys, before I go live because my hands are just so dry right now. Every February and March, it's like this. And then yesterday I was out and wearing hand sanitizer all day, and then I took off my nail polish before my last video. I had a major uh, spillage in the car of nail polish yesterday. Ugh, you guys, I'm so, I'm so angry with myself. Like, I touched up my polish before I did some more filming, and I thought I tightened it all the way. I thought I did, and then later in the night I kept smelling something, and it was white nail polish, you guys. <sighs> yeah. Anyways, I agonize over stuff like that when I when stuff happens and and you know I try to clean it up and uh. so if you guys have any tips for me, I used and I kind of kicking myself. I used nail polish remover and cotton balls, and then I kind of diluted the nail polish remover, and I think I should have just used. Um, I think I should have just used warm water and Dawn dish soap. I don't think I should have ever used it because it was down in the console area, like where you plug in your phone and it's like a little area where you can put like, you know, your phone or like your chapstick or whatever. So if anyone has any tips, I feel like I stained the material there a little bit. If anyone has any tips, please let me know. I, I really don't think I should have used nail polish remover. I'm kind of angry at myself. Anyways, enough about that. You guys are here for another haul, so let's get started. Hey, Tina, let's get started with another Dollar Tree haul. I went to two Dollar Trees yesterday. One was next to Target. The other one was Dollry, the one that I used to bring you guys to, the one that had the lights out, the one that we call Dollry. And by the way, when I was in Target, I got a $2 and some change bag of brownie M&Ms. And then I got these from Target's Dollar Spot. Oh yeah, Oscar, yours is at 75%. My Walmart was at 50%, but I didn't really see anything that I wanted. But aren't these cute? These are like little plastic oversized shower caps. They were just 50 cents yesterday. This was in Target's Dollar Spot. They look really cute. It has the little um, stitching there. They also had some sort of gray green print that I really didn't like that much. I like these. I thought they were super cute. So I just got two of those. 
And then I got two of these. I know you guys are here for Dollar Tree, but also in Dollar Spot, I got two of these Desirous. Did I say it right? Or is it Des Desiree? D-E-S-I-R-U-S. Yes, those were shower caps. Yes, but I got these from Target's Dollar Spot. These are the emergency four-piece sets. So if you are in Texas right now and you're scrambling um, and can't find cords that the cords that you need, check in Target's Dollar Spot. These were almost hidden. And so the, the set is really kind of nice. I'll open up one of these and show you guys. They call it the tech kit. I mean, you guys can see all the stuff on the picture, but you know how it is. Let me use this to, because my nails are too short right now. Okay, let's open it with, open the sticker. Okay, so here we go. So this cord can be used on all phones. Oh, desirous, okay, great. So we have the little um, microfiber cloth. We have a little cable wrap. Yay, you're here. We have this little container for cleaning your screen. I thought the container was great. I thought that might be a good little like body spray or fragrance mist um, bottle to rinse out and reuse you know? And then here's the cord. So we have the USB. We have the one for Apple phones. We have this one, Samsung phones, or Android. We have all three. I think it's, what does it say? Does it say the types? Micro USB, USB-C, and lightning. So yeah, I got two of these because I had this part of my cord get stuck in my phone yesterday and I was out without a cord and that just wasn't gonna do. Not with all the filming I had to do. So, okay, so I got those from Target's Dollar Spot and this was back in the clearance at my store. It was the only one. I paid $1.50 for this. It's by Opal House. Your sweet. I almost got the placemats, but isn't that cute, you guys? Hi, Jess. I thought it was so cute. I wish there would have been a couple more, but it was normally $3, but $1.50. I love the colors. Okay, let's go ahead and get on to Dollar Tree now that I showed you guys some of my Dollar Spot stuff. Okay, so let's start with this one. So the first store I went in, I found these. I thought they were so cute. I really wanna find the clear frogs. Hi, Linda. Aren't those cute, you guys? Look at the little ears. And then my store had a bunch of new spring towels. I don't really like the texture of these that much, but I just kind of got them for decoration. They also have a real like pink and orange and yellow variety. Little matching um, oven mitt. And I don't really recommend the oven mitts for super, super hot stuff because they're not the best. But again, I just thought it was kind of cute. Look at that cute little set. Isn't that cute, you guys? Hi in Texas. Do you have water? Do you have power? Those are super cute. They have, um, I did not see the matching um, pot holders. Is it buffering for you guys? I wonder if it's my family member doing, family members doing that. Is anyone else buffering? If so, I can call out to my family members and make sure they're not on the internet right now. The scratchy microfiber, yeah, Jess, they're, um, you know, if you, if your hands are dry and you you feel like your skin is snagging on them, it's kind of that kind. You can almost hear it. 
And that's what I don't like. I don't like my hangnails and my dry skin to catch on it. You have water and power, that's great. Okay, we're gonna keep it going. Now these, you guys, I was so impressed with these. These feel so nice and heavy. Like these feel like a three or four dollar towel. Hey Brian, these were over by the kitchen things. And this feels like a three or four dollar towel that you'd maybe find at Walmart or Family Dollar or something like that. This is the brand. It's the home collection. And I just got these for the bathroom. Yeah, Jess, that's a major pet peeve for me. These just feel so nice. Like, look how thick these are. This is just one towel. Can you guys tell how nice this is? I have a little um, gray rug that I use in the bathroom sometimes. And then right now I'm just currently using a white shower curtain. So sometimes it's a gray rug. Sometimes it's a blue rug or a pink rug or whatever. And then I like to have matching towels or sometimes I just do white towels, white shower curtain and bright colored rug. And then I got a couple more of these too, you guys. I realized I ran out of these. And this is a great deal. Hi, Christina in Indiana. So I didn't get much from the first store, just the gray towels and then these. This haul isn't gonna be as long as the other one, hopefully. And I just say that because I, um, not because I don't like hanging out with you guys, but just because I was uh, kind of blabbing away in the last one. <laughs> so I'm gonna try to have better control in this one and keep it a little shorter for you guys. Okay, aren't these cute, you guys? I've been looking for these for so long, and I thought we had some pastel ones, but these are brand new, you guys, the cute little favor boxes, and I thought I could use these for just all sorts of stuff. Stocking stuffers, um, birthdays, I could just, I could put candy in here, money, jewelry, little like whatever. You know what I mean? Like you could put a lot of things in here. Maybe you buy, bought a game, a used game or something off of eBay and you don't have the original packaging and you want to just stick it in here with some, um, hi, um, in Algeria. Maybe you want to put some little, like, um, what's that called? You guys know the little packaging paper? You could put some some of that in here and stick a game in here or some jewelry. Anyways, I thought they were really cute. And Dollar Tree has been coming up with a lot of new party things. Like, I've been really impressed. I also got this. It feels really cheap in the handle, like super cheap. But I bought that Eco Tools one from a couple weeks ago at Dollar, not Dollar Tree, but Walmart. You guys were shopping with me in one of my videos when I got the, the wooden eco tool one and the bristles. Hi, Nanoshka. I'm doing really good. Kind of tired today after a long day of being out yesterday filming, but yeah, I'm enjoying the day. These are cute, aren't they? Faithful Fawn. I'm like, these, these right here. This feels ultra cheap, but I'm hoping this is going to be really scratchy. Hi, Amazingly Ag in Vegas. You know, we think we might want to live in Vegas one day. How do you like living in Vegas? How do you like living in Vegas? We're, there's this channel here on YouTube that we watch, and it's like a real estate channel, and we just love it so much. We like we like the aesthetic of Vegas houses. Like, we are really feeling it, you know? But yeah, you guys, I got one of these. I think they had a couple um, other colors, and I don't know how good this is going to be, but... I figured I would just find it, find it, try it, let you guys know how I like it. It's amazing besides the weather. Is it just too hot there like most of the time? Look, you guys, I got another one of these. If you guys watch my videos, my video from earlier, I told you how much I love these and I found a store that had more. David, 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 you spamming David? What's up, David? <laughs> Hi, Gail. Thank you for this super chat. Thank you so much and the heart. Thank you so much. I really appreciate that. You guys never have to give me money, never have to send me anything or give me super chats. But when you do, I really do appreciate it. Thank you so much. 
I really appreciate that. Okay, you guys, about a week or so ago, I showed these in a thumbnail, and I believe these were going for $18.35 on Walmart, a little bit cheaper on um, at Macy's and on Macy's website. Look, you guys, the security tag. Now, I know I showed these yesterday if you guys were with me on my live, but I was kicking myself that I didn't get these the first time. These... Borghese, I was, someone helped me with the pronunciation, Borghese. This is the brand, you guys, Borghese. You guys know they've been making makeup and things for a long time. These are the real Borghese, not dupes. These are the real Borghese eye compresses, moisturizing eye compresses. This is what it looks like. Look at that. Yeah, Jess, it was. It's It's been so cold here lately, so cold, but it's going to start warming up. This weekend, we're going to have some temperatures in the 30s, and that's, compared to what we've been having, Jess, that's going to be, that's going to feel pretty nice. So this is what it looks like, you guys. You know what? Let's go ahead and open one. Let's open it. They are sealed. I double-checked to make sure that they were sealed in my store. I just have no nails, you guys. I just totally cut them off. Totally. I saw these pretty nails in Walgreens last night, you guys. I almost got them. They were the Kiss Jelly Nails. They were like the really light pink, kind of see-through almost. And then they had a couple like silver accent nails. I don't even know if I can do it, you guys. I'm Oh. Gator left a pair of scissors in here because I got them. I got him one of the mini skateboards at Five Below. And he had the scissors. Okay, let's see what we can do here. Okay. Of course, these are Dollar Tree scissors. Wow. Oh my gosh, you guys. I'm trying. Oh, Ladybug just flew by. <laughs> Oh my gosh, you guys, this is like so secure. Whoa, these are really, really um, wet inside. You guys see that? Like these are not dried up and old or expired like, oh my gosh, okay. Oh, that's new. That super chat you gave me, I can see it um, up in the top of my screen. That's definitely a new feature. This is what they look like. It looks like if you would take a paper towel and just saturate it, it almost looks like that. So this is what they look like. Let me smell. Hmm, they smell nice. They smell very, very lightly scented. So, so lightly scented. The moisture, it's not like the, the, the stuff they put in there. It's, um... I'm just calling it the moisture. It's not sticky. It's getting a tiny bit sticky, but you know what? I'm not going to discriminate because I did put lotion on. Remember, you guys, I started my video with putting on the dupe to Dolce & Gabbana's light blue. So these are the Borghese's. Again, they're at Dollar Tree. You get 30 30 in a container. Okay, you guys, the rest of my haul is gonna be pretty short so here's what I got and if you guys were with me yesterday I was showing all of the brand new we have so many brand new bolero products but we also have these and these are by hard candy stroke of gorgeous bold glitter mascara yes sparkling glimmering effect that lasts through the day it tells you what to do. This is the main mascara. I don't think you put this on top of a regular mascara. Let's see. It says um, apply on top and bottom for a bold, dramatic look or on tips or lower lashes for a pop of sparkle. So these are some brand new mascaras. And as much as I watch TikTok and other people's um, hauls and things like that, I have not seen anyone show these. 
So I was surprised to see them. This is what the glitter looks like. Look at it, you guys. Look at that. Wow, isn't that pretty? And they kept the brush out of the bottle. Okay, Craggy. Craggy's one of our kitties. Craggy, AKA Jared. Well, we thought Jared was a boy, but Craggy is actually a girl and her name is Craggy. My husband named her Craggy. <laughs> Look at that. Wow. Look at those. I mean, we're just taking a moment here. We're like, let's take a moment. You know what? Let's take it out of the box. Let's do that. Let's take it out of the box. What's up with you, David? Why are you spamming your name? What's going on? You just trying to make my moderators uh, work? <laughs> Crystal, let's. We will, okay? And my suggestion is open, open it from the bottom of the box because the top, I was having a really hard time getting it out from the top. So let's just, okay. Let's just rip the box open, actually. <laughs> Here is, oh no, now I got it in my rug. Very, very, um, very small and delicate applicator. Very, very small, like super tiny. Let's sit you here. Okay, Craggy. Someone will let you downstairs in a minute, Craggy. Okay, so here's what it looks like. Bold. Wow. Why am I so impressed with this? I don't know. It's just like, it's just kind of different. Okay, and it has this. And it has the, it has the little part here where you can, you know, push it down and scrape the side if you need to. So it's totally sealed and nice. I'm not going to put the wand in there right now, though. But yeah, that's a lot of product. I like that you could totally see how much product you're getting. It's not just like packaging and you get just a little bit. You get 0.4 ounces, so almost a half an ounce. Can you let Craggy down, honey? Sure. Let Craggy downstairs. She's in the kitchen. Sure. Craggy, yeah, I am. Oh, hi. Gator says hi. And Craggy says hi, too. <laughs> Okay, I also got these. These are the Maybelline Snap Scaras. On and a snap, off and a snap, but it lasts all day. Okay, smooth, clump-free, with volume, in Deja Blue. Azul Intenso. Yep, Azul Intenso. Do we have an expiration date on any of these? I wonder... Do we? Jess says, hi, Gator and Craggy. <laughs> I think this means use six months within opening. But I'm not seeing uh, any sort of expiration date anywhere. They're just telling us use within six months of opening. That's what it looks like on the bottom, RN07. It says RN07 on the bottom, but up here it says 330. So, yeah. Yeah. They also had a chocolate cherry. It was sort of like a brownish, a brownish red burgundy. And I almost got those. Then I was like, uh, I don't know. Thank you, Crystal. <laughs> and then we have even more. Okay, one is upside down. We have ultraviolet. Hi, Michelle. Ultraviolet. Look at that packaging. Ooh, and this is what it looks like. Yes. They say it's intenso. Azul intenso. And then we have ultraviolet. Ultravioleta. Again, on in a snap. Off in a snap. Lasts all day. Easy to remove. Have you guys tried these yet? On, on easy, off easy, but last all day. Does it really last all day? Hi, Carol Ann. Welcome. Everyone, welcome Carol Ann. 
Welcome to the Bunny Birdie Gator family. I'm so glad you could catch the live. Carol Ann, I found these yesterday in Dollar Tree. The Snap Scaras. Also the... Ooh, you got... You got Violet at TJ Maxx today. You got this one at TJ Maxx? How much was it at TJ Maxx? I like to know when they have them at other locations. Sometimes TJ Maxx and Ross has a lot of the same. Jackie, which one are you wearing right now? Ultraviolet or Azul Intenso? Or are you wearing Deja Blue? Hi, Ash. Yeah, everyone's welcome here. You got them all for a dollar. Dollar holla. You would love to try the violeta, the violet. Hi, Perla. I took it for many years in school. I always, my goal has always, I've always wanted to be um, bilingual, but I feel like I understand better than I can speak. I can read Spanish. I'm not perfect though. I still do have a hard time conjugating my verbs and saying everything properly, but I feel like I can read it and I can write it, but um, speaking it and making everything work correctly, I just feel like I need to, to live somewhere where I'm just only speaking Spanish for a while. Like, I would really love that. Like, I would really, really, really love that. I would love that for my kids as well. My parents always taught me Spanish words um, here and there when here and there when I was a kid and I just always loved Spanish. I just did. So hi Angelica. I'm sorry, what were you saying? Tina Marie said what? That's my girl. We've collabed before. She said what? Dala Dala Hala. <laughs> She's down in Texas right now. I saw her um, post on Instagram and she was showing the long line to wait to get in the grocery store and showing the HEB grocery store that, um, that it was like there was empty shelves and everything. But she showed her couple bags of groceries at the end, so I'm really happy she was able to get some groceries. You guys, I have one more item. Yeah, I did not get the black cherry. I just got these, two of these two of these. I mean, and for the price of one mascara, I got six. I hope you guys do the same. If you want to treat yourself or your mascara is a little old, run out and get yourself some fun mascaras. I actually bought a blue mascara within the last six months that I haven't used yet. And I have been wanting to because I heard it looks really nice with brown eyes and I have brown eyes and I have really been wanting to do blue and just kind of have fun with that but I just haven't gotten around to it but you guys I do have one more hard candy item to show you guys and this is the only one I saw this is um what moisturizer Darlene this is the long wear primer I'll show you what's in the jar if you missed it here in just a second, honey. This is the long wear primer, 12 hour primer. Put this on after your moisturizer. I think you do moisturize, then prime, and then put on any like concealer, foundation, whatever. But yeah, I found this yesterday. This is the long wear primer. So this will just like help your makeup stay on longer and better. And look, you guys, it's a big container, 1.58 ounces. Okay, so... Um, you were asking what was in the containers. Okay, these are the Borghese Botanico Eye Compresses that sell in places like Macy's. And also um, Walmart sells these online. And I think last time I checked, they were selling for like $18.35 each. This is the, the brand Borghese that you've been hearing about. I think my mom had some of the makeup, some of their makeup like in the 90s. I think they make skincare and makeup, but these are the Borghese eye compresses and they look very fresh. There's like a lot of liquid in here. I have not used anything like this ever. I opened this, if you weren't here to see that I opened it, it was very hard to open. It smells um, just barely like anything. And it says, so this is, um, 
Princess Marcella Borghesi out of New York. Um, the website, borghesi.com. Infused with a blend of soothing botanicals, these compresses yes a dollar these compresses help hydrate the fragile eye area key benefits include soothes refreshes reduces signs of puffiness let's do this since i have it at home now i can kind of tear the bottle up if i want and it says on cleansed skin place one compress over each eye, lie down and relax for 10 minutes. I think that's my favorite part. Now, once you open it, I believe you have 12 months to use these. I think that's how it works. They don't really post an expiration date, but they say once you open it, you have 12 months to use it, or they recommend 12 months. And it looks like we have witch hazel in here. Water, witch hazel, um, and a whole bunch of other ingredients. But yeah, these are the Borghese Botanico Eye Compresses. And then just to show you guys, if you missed my hauls from earlier, I did show a couple other hard candy items. So all in all, besides the glitter mascara, here are the hard candy skincare items that I've gotten lately. Um, where's the other one? Is there one more? I thought there was one more, maybe not. This one, this one, this one. Oh, okay, so I have a color correcting primer and then I have a long wear primer. So these are some of the items that are out right now. And these normally go for between like eight and $12 each. Hi, silly mommy, how are you? I'm glad you said hi, how have you been? Yep, all of these are available at Dollar Tree. You guys just keep looking. Um, keep asking your cashiers and your store managers if they have any. These items are going fast, and sometimes you might only see like one on the shelf. Like, go to your area, your skincare and your makeup aisles, and just stand there and just stare for a while. You guys know how I do in my videos. I just st stand there and stare and just hope something like pops up and says, look at me, I'm new, you know? Because at a glance, you won't even see these items. You like hard candy, affordable even at full price. Yep. But I have to say this, even though hard candy stuff is um, pretty affordable at full price, when I was at Walmart yesterday, I didn't see any of these items in the hard candy section. And then, of course, you guys remember the palettes? Hopefully you guys found some a few months ago. Do you guys remember the big eyeshadow palettes we found? Those are also by hard candy. And I believe those sell for like $10 in Walmart. So... I love that Dollar Tree has been getting a nice selection of these items and we can have fun and try them out and get one for our best friend or get one for our sister or get one for our mom or, you know, save them for Easter or gifts and we can like treat ourselves and feel like, hey, even if we walked away from Dollar Tree with a bunch of boring things for the household, maybe at least we got ourselves a cute new mascara to try out. Or maybe we got, you know, something nice for self-care, you know, for someone in the family. So I love that aspect. Like if I walk out of Dollar Tree with one fun item that I wasn't expecting to see or that was on my list and I found it, like I am really happy. Like I will go into Dollar Tree and look for that one item that I know costs $18.35 somewhere else. And I'm like, okay, the fact that it's $18.35 somewhere else and it's a dollar right now in Dollar Tree, like I wanna get it and try it because I feel like I'm getting a great deal, you know? But anyways, you guys, oh, one more reminder for Walgreens this week. I know you guys love to save money like me, so you can get three bottles of Purex for $6 this week, no coupon needed, just scan your rewards card. I don't even know if you need to get your rewards card scanned. No coupons needed, no digitals needed. You can get three Purex for $6 this week at Walgreens or three bags of the Purex pods. I really like this brand. Like I love Tide, Tide with Oxy. I love... Um, Ah, oh, the Purex is nice. The Purex is really nice. Let me smell it again. I really like this Mountain Breeze. 
The Mountain Breeze smells really good. Bless you, honey. The Mountain Breeze smells really nice. Uh, the Linen and Lilies, I don't like as much. But it's nice. I mean, it smells just very light and fresh. But you guys know me. I was trying to go for the bottles that had, yes, the pods too. I was trying to go for the 38 load bottles. They also have the fragrance-free varieties. I think there's all in all like five to six different uh, scents in the jugs. And then um, two different types of pods. And listen, you guys, I have the best secret to share with you guys. Some of you might be like, eh, that's, that's nothing new. But listen, are you guys ready? Are you guys ready for the best secret of the week to remember? If you go to a place like Walgreens or if you go to a place like Target and they don't have that super amazing sale item that you're looking for, don't be sad and don't be down that you couldn't get that great deal. Here's what you do. Are you guys ready? You, you, you'd be really happy about it, especially if you're a couponer and you know you can get it for even cheaper. But what you do is you ask for a rain check. You ask for a rain check. So if you go to Walgreens and your Walgreens is sold out, you ask for a rain check. They'll fill out a little slip and they'll say, how many do you want? And at that point, you can say however many you want. Now, if they're strict on limits, they might say, well, the limit on this product is six, which it is, but I think it's six per fragrance. So you say, I'd like a rain check for 12 of these. And usually a rain check is good for like a year. So now you can pick and choose and you have the secret little weapon. You have the secret little savings in your purse or, you know, with your coupons or whatever. And you can go in when you need it the most or even go in when you have a Purex coupon. Sometimes stores will accept coupons and rain checks. Oh my gosh, you guys. Like, so sometimes I, I get down. I'm like, oh, I couldn't get it today. If I really needed it, sometimes I get down. But sometimes I just want to get it because I know it's a great deal and I just want to add it to my, my you know, my stash. And I've been, I, I got a lot of these yesterday, you guys. I thought I was going to have to ask for a rain check, but they had tons. It's a snow check. Yes, definitely a snow check this time of year. But I get really happy about rain checks. And, you know, I sometimes even make a list. Like, okay, if I'm shopping and I realize that they're just out of, like, everything I need, like, that's the case sometimes in Walgreens, then I'll just start making a little list in my phone. Okay, oh, this, these are the things I want to ask for a rain check. This, this, this. And, um, oh, I'm so happy they make you happy. Your comments and you guys being here sharing that with me really makes my day. Because I love saving you guys money. I love saving you guys money. I love helping you guys be better providers for your family and get nice, affordable, cheap things for yourself. Because you guys all deserve to treat yourself. Hey, even if it's not in the budget, we can all treat ourselves with a little something. And Always just pick up a little something for yourself, even if you only spend a dollar. But yeah, you guys, rain checks. I love rain checks. And I have a nice collection of them in my purse for various things from Fiji water to different detergents. And sometimes I just make sure I have the right coupon and then try to use my rain check along with my coupon at the same time. And sometimes I'm getting things for pennies that way. But yeah, I know rain checks are kind of a thing of the past, or we might have heard our moms or grandmothers talking about it back in the day, but a rain check, a rain check should be trending <laughs> because, you know, you could just get as much as you want of that item, as much as they'll let you get, and you can get it when you want, and you don't have to wait on that sale, and you don't have to scramble around and try to get enough. You can go in there when they're back to being fully stocked again, and then you can get your amount that you want. And also, with rain checks, you guys can say, for example, you want 10 of something, right? But maybe you don't want to get 10 or can't get 10 all in one day. My my one particular Walgreens I go to, they will subtract. They'll say, oh, you want four today? Okay, they'll scratch it out and then they'll make that 10 of six. And now I can just basically for a whole year or so many months, I can go in there and I can get that item at that price whenever I need it and just use my rain check. 
they have never taken the rain check and said, sorry, you can only use it once. So ask for a bunch if they'll let you. And then the whole year you buy detergent, you're buying it for a dollar or two dollars. And you just know you can count on that. Like that has saved me a lot of money. And that's given me a lot of happiness too. But anyways, that's my rain check. Uh, my rain check chant. Chant. No, not chant. Nope. That's not the word. <laughs> you guys rant. The rain check rant. What is wrong with me? <laughs> Anyways, you guys, I'm always so tired the day after filming and being out all day. I'm still like in my pajamas, in my lounge pants, and have my cozy, um, cute but ugly vintage sweater on. Just sitting here on the floor, nice and cozy with you guys, sharing the deals. But hey, you guys, I'm out of here. I am off to edit videos for tomorrow. I also have to get a voiceover ready for TikTok. You guys, um, check out my TikTok I'm about to put up. It is going to be something that I make on the wax melt burner. I have it pre-filmed, but I'm going to go do the voiceover. You guys... It's going to be cute, and if you love cooking sizzles, you're going to love this one because we are going to have some amazing cooking sizzles over on TikTok at Bunny Birdie Gator. You guys follow me. Brand new content dropping really soon. Um, as soon as I can get in the studio and do the voiceover, and you guys will see my brand new TikTok. I'm really trying my best to put up content every day on TikTok as well. Sometimes... Um, I feel like if I'm trying a different time, maybe it really didn't do well. So every once in a while, if I have one that doesn't do well, I might take it down and then try at a better peak time. But basically, you guys can count on like, let's just say six to eight pieces of content over on TikTok as well from me every week. And I'm always cooking on Dollar Tree wax melt burner. I made some sausage that I got from Dollar Tree a few days ago. Made some sausage, the little dollar sausage. Gator said he liked it. I only let him have the little tiny one, though. Everything I'm making, by the way, you guys, is mini. Super mini and cute. But okay, you guys, I'm out of here. I love you guys so, so much. Thanks for hanging out at my house with me. I have a lot of videos planned for you guys. A lot. Two videos a day. Monday through Friday, and then on the weekends, it's just single videos. But like I said, you guys can also follow me over on TikTok because I have more content dropping there as well. So yeah, you guys, it was fun. Now I have a big, I have a big mess to clean up, don't I? A big mess. <laughs> but all right, you guys, have a great night. I love you guys so, so much. To those of you in Texas, my thoughts are with you. Hang in there. Do what you have to do to stay warm and dry. And, and just hang in there. I'm hoping you guys all get your water back, you all get your power back, and you can get back to your normal busy lives and your normal happy lives. I'm really thinking about you, you guys, and my heart goes out to you guys. Just hang in there, try to stay warm, try to find a project to dig into if you can, and um, hopefully everything will be back to normal for you guys real, real soon. My thoughts are with you. Okay, I love you guys so, so much.